Hi, here we are uh, I'm talking to Ethan Bixby who uh, helped organize the uh, 2012 Worlds and we're uh, in the middle of this awesome uh, thunderstorm in uh, St. Pete's. Ethan, yep, yep. so... Uh, lightning in the background. Yeah, it's awesome. So uh, congratulations on uh, our one day uh, US Open uh, Thank you. Thank you. championship. You uh, were first uh, for the US fleet right. to yeah. uh, win yeah. that trophy. And uh, how did you feel out there? You have uh, the new uh, rig and uh, yep. some new sails. Yep, second day, uh, second day of sail the new boat. Finally got it rigged. Oh, and uh, a new boat, brand new boat. Brand new too. boat, it's in the water second day um, with a new rig, slightly changed mainsail design, and uh, everything felt good. The boat worked, nothing broke. Um, I was actually quite happy with it. I did a little bit of tuning before the racing, and uh, the boat was fine. It felt good. It felt uh, very competitive upwind. Uh, my technique downwind is not quite as good as some of these guys. Oh yeah. <laughs> but uh, reaching in particular. Yeah. Uh, but it was really fun and it felt really good to be competitive upwind. So oh, that's, that's good. Yeah, definitely downwind if you if they can pump, and good. even sometimes when yeah. they can't, yeah. uh, they really can move through. I, the I don't have that laser sailor background. Yeah. So I'm not that great at that, that, that style. Good. So I'm looking for the spinnaker. <laughs> <laughs> And uh, so next week uh, we start on Tuesday, right? Yep. And um, the race committee said we can expect all sorts of conditions. So yep. we I think we should have some wind early, and then we we'll get a little bit lighter and sunnier later in the week. Okay. Nice. Yep. Great. Yep. And uh, how you must have uh, been working hard and long on this, organizing the yeah, event. Yeah. But really, all the really credit goes to Bob Birkenstock. He's he's the main guy that's done all the work. Okay. Good. Ask a few questions and help out. But well, that's awesome. He's the main guy. Oh, yeah. good. The yacht club's done a great job. Well, you've been sanding and varnishing yeah, your boat. Yeah, I've been sanding and varnishing. <laughs> I got to learn how to varnish, too. <laughs> good. So, um, and we're very impressed with the uh, 43 boats. So yeah, that's really like good. That. We yep. had three containers come over. Yep. And uh, the normal crew of U.S. and Canadian yep. fleets. It's really good for our class, the American class, the right. North American class, to have a good event here. And it's yeah. going to work out. It's the biggest uh, contender event in North America, I believe. Yes, this is the biggest thing yep. ever. Yep. So that's really encouraging to see. And some new boats in the fleet, which is also really nice. Yeah, we've got a bunch of brand new boats down. So hopefully yep. we can keep trying to get together in between our yeah. world championships. We decided our country is really too big. We're spread out too far. Yeah. <laughs> <We're gonna laughs> Yeah, it is always a challenge for the class, you know, like, uh, especially the population base seems to be quite yeah. disparate rather yeah. than in uh, Europe yeah, often. Yeah, so. in, in the West Coast and the South and, the, yeah. and uh, New England and yeah. Ohio and yeah. California. Yeah, yeah. New so Hampshire. it's good to get everyone together. Yep. Yeah. It's really good. Well, we should have a really good regatta here. I think it's good. We've got some great sailors here. It should be a lot of fun. Good race committee work and sailing in the Gulf of Mexico, except for today, is really nice. Yeah. <laughs> So well, I went out earlier. Sailing. It was okay. Yeah. Yeah, all <laughs> the sailing dramatic. we've had here has been really good so far. Yeah, good. Yeah, been great. Well, uh, congratulations, and you. hopefully you do great next week. I'm going to try. Okay, right. good. Thanks. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.